Hut. Octane man, down here at RBA, Richmond, Virginia, hooking up with my man Young Yankee uh -huh. at Charged Up Studios, Charged man. Up. I'm about to get y'all a little insight on my man, let, let y'all know what's going on with him, what he's got going on in the studio right now. So, just for the people that don't know, introduce yourself to the world. You already know, it's your boy Yankee, aka Snow That Kelly, Charged Up song, you know, I engineer, produce, etc. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready to take this shit by storm, you heard? Hear that, yo. Yeah. So, as far as that goes, um, you just dropped that new joint, Versatile, a couple Versatile, weeks ago. Versatile, yes. It's on live mixtapes. Get that. That joint is hosted by DJ Infamous. Shout and it's out pretty to tough, him. man. You know what I'm saying? Every genre is on there, you heard? So, you um, produced the whole thing. Nah, not at least like 65, 70%. You know <laughs> 65, 70? 70%, you know what I'm saying? Something like that, but you know, pretty much all of them, for real. Um, you know what, what got you into into producing? Um, It was pretty random, know what I'm saying? But I, I basically like hearing, like when I used to listen to music on the radio, know what I'm saying? Some of the tracks I really fell in love with, you know what I mean? But I always wanted to alter something in, in one of the tracks, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, screw it, I might as well make my own. This way I ain't gotta worry about that problem, know what I'm saying? So yeah. it went from there as far as making beats, man, you know what I'm saying? And you're originally from New York, right? Yeah, Boogie Down Bronx, Southern Boulevard. So just knowing that and having that history, um, what producers did you look up to um, growing up? Inspired you to to produce? Ah, uh, it's on. It's, it's pretty much three of them. Ryan Leslie, he inspired me a lot. You know what I'm saying Ryan Leslie, A Rap music. You know what I'm saying because I liked his style. A rap music, and then it was just Blaze. You know just Blaze. Yeah, that's my top three right there. You know yo, I respect that. That's a dope top up. three, yo. Up. Ryan Leslie, I used to watch him on YouTube. Yeah, yeah, amazing, man. Yeah, amazing yeah, cat, yeah. man. So, pretty much your job here at Charged Up is you're an engineer, producer, rapper. How does that work? Chandler. You know <laughs> Word up, all that, man. I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty smooth, man. It's fun, actually, man. I like I like the people's reaction as far as, like, engineering. Okay. How they feel, like, as far as, like, me me putting my all into somebody else's work. And yeah. I just want it by myself, you know what I'm saying? I like that. And then the producer, that's just a plus, you know what I'm saying? Because most of the time, people wouldn't even realize I make beats until they, they was to come through. Yeah. And I show them something, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, man, that's... Pretty much it, man, on that, man. So do you make all your beats here, or you make some at the crib? Like, yeah, all of them here, oh, all in-house, you know what I'm saying? That's all wild. in-house, yeah. That's wild. So how did you hook up with Charge Up? Because I know they've been, I've known them for doing studios since I was probably like 19, 20, so I know they've been around for a minute. How did you yeah. hook up with them? Well, basically, I um I was living around in Rico at the time, right. and I met I met a group they had called the Five Footers. You know what I'm saying? Just be chill, all the problem, you know what I'm saying? I started rapping with them, but I was already making beats. Right. And they, they was in need of beats. They had a studio in their crib. They lived downstairs, I live upstairs, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how we somehow started chopping it up. And he got his word out about it. Now, yeah, I rap so and so. I'm like, yeah, I'm upstairs making beats. So he like, yeah, you should come through, you know what I mean? So take some beats downstairs, and we kind of went from there. You know what I mean, they introduced me to Fire Marshal Skrill, which was um the first engineer here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? He, he introduced me to Pro Tools. And then I took the information he gave me and just, I mean, branched off. Man. No doubt. Yeah. I've been you in the studio me? with you. I seen you um, engineering people's projects. Yeah. How do you get the confidence to just go in and just start chopping stuff down while they while they're recording? Because I seen you do that before. It's, it's, yeah, I mean, crazy. you see, as far as that man, I just be trying to like, I, right, I'm let me eliminate some work. Why? Because it's a lot of work that be, can be done while pressing buttons. You don't have to press buttons and then wait for them to finish, you know what I'm saying, just to go to the next track to record. When you could be, I, I could cut the breaths out of his, his, his verse 
You know what I'm saying? So you won't hear that. I could do a lot of extra stuff, you know what I mean? Clipping all the dead, the dead air, dead space, you know what I'm saying? Then by the time you done laying the track, it's already clean and prepared to mix. You know what I'm saying? So, me? I think that, you think that's something that sets you apart and is that something that you learn from somebody else or is that something that you just picked up along the way? I mean, all of them, for real. All of them. You know what I'm saying? I, I picked up from Squirrel, you know what I'm saying? But, and it's also an advantage for me because I can mix my voice better than anybody else's, you know what I mean? Because it's my voice. I saw that, yeah. Thank All right. Man. The Versatile Project. It's out, it's in the streets, it's hot, you got it out there. So, what was the inspiration behind it? What makes you come up with the name Versatile? I just feel like it ain't no limit to what somebody could do, you know what I'm saying? So, I ain't go, I'm not gonna sit in the studio, I got a studio, you know what I mean? Why well, I'm gonna sit in here and make one particular kind of music when I have the ability and, and the access to make everything and, and capture all, every every aspect of music, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I could just, I could captivate and, and, and like uplift a lot of people instead of just the people in my circle, you know what I'm saying? So, that's where Versatile came from. Pretty much do everything, you know what I'm saying? So how would you, is that how you describe your style as an artist? Because I've absolutely. seen you straight up rap to yeah. like, you know, to some R&B yeah, stuff, yeah, so. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Wait. Where did that come from, matter of fact? Where did the, the R&B and, and all that <laughs> come from? Making R&B beats. Yeah. Making R&B beats, man, and just harmonizing all the time, man. I just feel like, hey, let's do that too. You know? So you are versatile, you probably could do that. And sure enough, man, that's another that's another attribute to add, you know what I'm saying? So where we where we taking this? Like, where's, what's the next move for Yankee? Are you putting out more visuals for, for versatile? Definitely. Are you gonna, moving on to the next project? Gonna, or what, what's going we're on? Gonna, we're going to shoot for visuals first, man. We're going we're gonna to give give people stuff to see, you know what I'm saying? Give them, give them an inside look on Yankee, you know what I mean? And then, see, meanwhile, while all that's going down, I'm already working on my third project, you know what I'm saying? The second one's done already. Right. I'm working on my third one, but until all that, is, is set into place and ready for like, you know what I mean, exposure. We're gonna work on exposing, you know what I'm saying? My brand and everything else, you know what I mean? I hear that. Word up. Well, let everybody know where they can reach you to get your music, follow you, mm -hmm. Instagram, Twitter, all that. Just let everybody well, know where they know. Hit you. It's Yankee Music 2014. That's on everything, man. Twitter is Yank is young underscore Yankee. You know what I mean? Y U N G underscore Yankee. SoundCloud Yankee Music. Know what I'm saying? You can find me, you can Google me. Google Google Yankee and then Charged Up and everything is gonna pop up, man. I'm here, know what I'm saying? I'm gonna keep bringing you that high fire, you heard? Word. Up. Yeah. Charged Up. Follow me at Octane underscore seven on Instagram, Octane underscore 33 on Twitter. Keep following the movement, man. Good looking Yankee. You already know. My man. Hmm. Look out for that versatile mixtape. Make sure y'all go download that on that piff live mixtapes anywhere you can get it at, man. Peace. Yeah. Hustling cause I got it. Keep it G, different day, different dollar. Trying to live proper cause I know to find the things for me. Yeah.